Welcome my Capricorns. Welcome. This is my monthly business reading for um, the month of June. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful um, support um, of this channel. I can't wait to reach. <laughs> so, um, okay, Capricorn. So what is happening? Capricorns, remember, um, there's a weekly business reading. So all you business people and people who work or entrepreneur, um, you got to check out the weekly business reading because I'm blown away. Um, a lot of people have been saying, wow, um, it is exactly um, what you have said um, to inspire. So um, I guess it is helping a lot of people. So um, you have to be um, open for these readings. OK, so whatever is transpiring. um let me see how, okay so um think positive whatever is transpired i see number 22 comes out number 22 um is the situation where you're so angry angry at your enemy i don't know who this person is but if i was this person stay out of a angry capricorn woman way because trust me she's taking you down all right she's going to take you down so whoever you are i see in the week, the last week of um, June, I see something with your enemy, okay? And I see um, your enemy and uh, um, especially you young people, young people between the age of 18 and 45, be aware of your enemy because I don't know who this person is, but you young people, be aware of your enemy. You have a male enemy and this person is just disturbed. It's a very disturbing person. So, um... I had to advise someone um, who is listening to this. So if you're in between the ages of 18 and 35, uh, 18, 35, 40, be aware of uh, this person, okay? You have an enemy. Um, this could be um, someone in a company. Um, I see that this is a situation where um, there's an older person in a company that wanted to be involved with you and you would say no. I see they're sending a, a someone and and um, harassing you. You're being harassed by an imposter, but I see he's going to be trapped. Okay, I see he's going to be trapped. So they are, you know, whoever this person is and what they're trying to do, I think they want to put you in fear and they send someone to like, um, you know, um, an impeder. So this could be um, someone that is sending you mail or is um, trying to, um, yeah, it's, it's like um, this person is kind of like want to arrest you in whatever way. But um, the women 50 years and older, you have saw this impeder and you know that he's there. So young people, you need to find out. That is an impeder that is, is trying to trap you and block you. And it is um, a couple from another country or another situation. But I see they're going to be trapped. Okay. <coughs> Sorry. So you got to be aware of this. Okay. So you Capricorns are dealing with the enemy, but this person is trapped. He and his partner and his criminal little clique is a trap. Okay. So you got to be aware of this now. I see some good news is going to be coming in in the spirit. It doesn't really matter when it affects your life. Some good news is going to be coming in for um you um Capricorns. Um, so you could apply for a job or you could get an honor, you could get an award, but whatever it is, it is good positive news that is coming in. Now, when we look at this um situation, this woman um she is confronting our enemy. Uh, this woman is like she's not playing whoever this capricorn and uh, whether capricorn woman or man whoever this capricorn woman or man is they're like hey i see you i know who you are uh, get away from me okay because um you you haven't learned a lesson but i'm going to teach you a lesson so i don't know who this this person is but you women and you business women and you um you know people in um like I high um top of professionals, I see you are going to confront your enemy and you're going to confront this enemy and whatever is happening and who this person, they're an impeder 
um this person is um an impeder is illegal someone else had sent this person um it's like to put fear in you and you're like i see you and i don't care because trust me I have nothing to lose. So you want to play this and you want to dance with me? Let's do this. Because whatever is transpiring, I see people are trying to send people to like, um, uh, it's like they're sending people to make you um, fearful or that sort of a thing or, or, or trap you or try to trap you in a situation. Could be a work situation where they're sending you wrong information and trying to trap you in a situation. And I'm seeing this sort of a situation where um, it's two people overseas. These two people are criminals, okay? Now, um, let me explain who these two people are. So, uh, some of you could have met someone overseas that said that they were a businessman. They were no businessman. This person was just trying to pick up one job from here to there and has not made anything of their life it was absolutely no business person now whatever has transpired you realize that this person um asks you to do to do some business which they never paid you for because they couldn't pay you because they were looking for financial help for you but whoever this person is it was as if this person is trying to um portray something that they weren't and you realize that this person was just false as the day they were born. But you think, give them the benefit of the doubt, okay? Because this is a, a man that you're dealing with. Give them the benefit of the doubt. Because, um, you know, um, trying to help. And I think that this is how you're seeing it. So you could have either, you know, this man had reached out to you to do a business or this man wanted to do business with you. But for some reason, I see that this person was like, um, you were like, hey, I don't know. There's, uh, I'm, you know, I'm not getting a yes. I'm not getting a yes as to um, whether or not I should do this. Okay. So, um, you know, it is a situation where it is, um, you're not really saying yes. You're not really saying no. You're just uh, looking at what is happening and what is transpiring. And um, so you have not gotten in touch with this person. So you just let it go because something was very off with this person. So it could be someone that applies at your company and, uh, you know, you have never accept their um, whatever, you know, you, you find... You, you have their, their CVs, um, but, you know, there is something just off by this person. Whatever is transpiring, there is just something that was off by this person. So you didn't really get involved. It could be a, a person on the work floor also. And I see that you are going to be finding out that there was some, that your contract was changed without you even knowing this. And I see you are going to be blazing and like just a blazing blazing whatever contract it is or whatever um you are going to be like a blazing okay so um um and you're going to be upset because you're going to be like you know don't you think that you should first um you know um the most professional way is like um to Ask me, because I, I think some of you, your contract was changed because they don't want to pay you anymore. So they changed your contract without your advice or they didn't advise you of this. And I see you are going to be very, very upset because I, I see you're going to be saying, you know, um, I did not. Uh, I did not give any permission to change my contract. So however, this is coming up. Um you are going to be so upset and then you're going to be finding out that your enemy is the one that changed your contract and i see you're going to be pulling in and bringing in the big boys in order to resolve this situation i really see you pulling in and opening up and bringing the big boys in order to um heal this situation because i see that you're going to be realizing I don't think so. I really don't think so. This is what you said. This is what we talked about. And this is how it's going to go. 
So it could be a situation where some of you, um, a reorganization is coming up in a company. They want to keep you, but they want to keep you for the same amount. And I see you have been working at this company for how many years? And I see that um, they want to um, re- And you're going to be like, no, I don't care who you are. I said, no, this is unprofessional. Um, this is not... And, Whoever that needs to sign this contract or whoever this person is, this person and their an association or this person and their secretary or this person and whoever is a very deceptive person, a very deceptive person. And I see that someone is going to stop in and said, no, no, um, this contract was what was um, offered. It's not my problem that it took so long. And you're going to say no, okay? So whatever is transpiring, don't be sad. Stand up. It's no time to cry, Capricorns. It's, it's time to stand your ground. Um, and whatever the secret contract is and was, I see you're going to be successfully overcoming and finding out of the lies and deceptiveness where a secret contract behind your back was done without you even knowing. And you are going to be um, bringing the bell at the alarm and you're going to be really taking down your enemy because this is someone who has been um, um, assisting you. And this is someone on the work floor. So I see your enemy. They're going to be finding out that some of you have an enemy. But before um, there is um, this situation, um, the um, stinger and... Uh, uh, oh, flower back. Um, they're going to be finding out that a young person as um, it's as if a young person tried to uh, impede you, a young impeder, and they trap this person. You're going to trap this person. So it, it could be a situation where someone at the office or someone at, that has been pretending to be you. Um, that is an impeder is someone who is pretending to be you and whoever this young person is they had made a secret contract for this young person under your name under your information under your identity and you are going to say hell no because you're trapping this person you're trapping this person so whoever your enemy is is connected to this young person and use your information um, to bring in this impeder in a country and I see you trap this person totally and you're like listen to me back up because you don't know who I am okay you can't just pick up my information get your little buggy buggy on my information my contract secret contract this is the person that has created a secret contract whether it's a mortgage whether it's a contract at work whether it's a contract with a company this deceptive man as use your information to get a woman or someone and created some secret contract and it's all coming out now all coming out so um i see you in this in in the first week the fifth week of the 15 you are blazing and you're taking back your name and your game i see you're blazing and you're taking back your name and your game about what has been happening and transpiring. I see you're letting the cat out of the bag because whoever your enemy is, they're going to see they're, they're impeder and they're going to trap them because you are taken back. And I see you're going to be receiving a new um, contract of, and something unexpected of um, an excuses. They're going to be, um, ex you know, saying, I'm sorry about what has transpired because I see, you know, you Capricorn, you have been working very hard. You have been doing your best. You have been moving forward. And there is just someone, whoever this man is, this man is seriously sick and someone need to help this man. So it could be your boss. It could be someone in a company. It could be someone, um, that is trying to take your information and has made, as and, and this is a really sick man and the, the the problem is that you capricorns are thinking how the hell this could have gone through if someone in um an institute is not sending this through how could this has gone through someone at the top is accessing some documents and changing some things and i see you capricorns are going to be working and said hell no hell no no I don't think so. So whoever this person is, they're going to be finding out 
that this person is an imposter and this person is an intruder. And I'm seeing here that this person has created a secret contract for a younger person in, uh, in under, under your contract. And in, and you know, some of you Capricorns are going to be finding out that someone in a government, in, in an institute, see, that has to do with either a personal person or so as to carry in their side piece check on your information. And I see they're going to trap this person because they found out this man, what he has been doing, that he has been smuggling people on the other people information in different countries and around the world on the people information. And I see you Capricorns are really taken down and you're canceling the contract of this person and said, hell no, hell no. You go back where you are from. I don't know you. Don't use my information. I see you are canceling the contract of this person and said, and trapping because you trap this person. This person can't go in and out. Okay. So, Cause whether it's in your company, this young person, I've been working, um, against you. Um, this is, um, you have, and a young person in your company has been working against you. And this person is an imposter. And I see you Capricorn kind of fig figure what is going on. And you cut this shit down and you're blocking this. And you're saying, you know, you people return where you're from. Because guess what? This is not working here. You know, the wrong person at the wrong time. Because when Capricorns, Capricorns are people who they're confronting you. Okay. You're a Capricorn enemy. They're going to let you know that, Hey, I know who you are. Okay. You stay as far as um you can from me. Cause whenever you throw your blow, I'm going to throw back my blow. Okay. And I think that this was just a deceptive move that has transpired. You're going to be finding out uh, that someone who um come to you for to in order to connect as business, he and his wife or he and his partner is an imposter. They are going to be finding out that this man is no businessman. Um, this man is a hustler. Okay, this this man is a hustler, and this man tried to use uh, your information in order to hustle in people under your name. And I see you blow up the tent and you let out people and. They trap this imposter and his wife. So they are trapped. Whoever your enemy is, they trapped him and his wife because they saw that they were imposter and they are not from either that country or whatever it is. I see they're going to be trapping your enemy and his wife or his side piece chick or whoever. And um, this person was just a hustler and this person was using your information and this person connect with other people information. This person could have been on some of you computer or phones accessing your data without even you knowing. And they are going to trap this person and their side piece chick and whoever this person is and whatever that was transpired. And you Capricorn could be working in a government institute or organization. It could be you working for a huge corporation that realized that this person who said that they were um, a businessman was just a hustler and uh, he was controlled by some um, crazy ass criminal at the top and you're taking them down. Okay. So I see whoever this young imposter is, uh, um, uh, is very sad. Your business, uh, uh, you, that is not because some of you are going to be finding out that you're working with this person or this person and connect with you or this person as because they made a secret contract um, for this person and you're going to rip it out and take it back. It's as if they use your information to give this person some stay in another country and it has to do with your enemy. Your enemy, this this gigolo, um, whoever this person is, this is a gigolo, this is a hustler um, and his wife. <laughs> His wife is going to get out of this, but he is not going to get out of this. He and his little side piece or whatever this is, um, this is a young person. This man is a hustler and this man use your information in order or use you to change someone information. And this person is a hustler that sell people information. Okay. That he sells people information. He's no business person. He can't even wipe his ass properly. Um, there is, this person is just no business person. Okay. 
And this person was working for this criminal person that is your greatest enemy. And I see you took off on them. And um, whoever this person is, they created a secret contract uh, using your name and your information. And I see they trapped him because they found out uh, um, what this person, and I see they're going to be um, um, apologizing to you. They're definitely going to apologize to you. Um, so you dark hair, black hair women, you're going to be apologized to. Some unexpected information is going to be coming in to you and they're going to be apologizing to you because they find out uh, that this little imposter and his wife were selling people information, getting on people's phone, pretending to be a businessman, but he was just an hustler. It was an hustler. It was a bad hustler because trust me, um, as you hustle, um, you know, it was a bad hustler, has a whole lot of side piece chick that he sells them information, send them off to different place on the people's information. He works for a bigger criminal and, uh, um, I see people are going to be apologizing, um, because they're going to catch the big, the, the, the big fish. Okay. So it's a situation where, um, you could be an, um, an immigration lawyer, you could be a lawyer, you could be a notary, you could be someone that is helping people to see um, people whose information that was used. Um, you could be um, a personal officer that saw that a young person came in an organization, but an older person was in an organization under the same name and as the same information. And I see an organization is going to be finding out and alert you people that someone else is using your information and they have already picked up the person because they gave the information to the authority. So it could be you doing it or um, um, it could be you doing it or an organization and a company has realized that a younger person has been um, using and they're going to catch them because it has to do with this man. Whoever this man is, this man is a hustler. It's not a businessman. This man pretend to be a businessman. He works for a bigger criminal man. This bigger criminal man is your enemy. Now, your enemy could have been created from a boss or um, someone you have done business before, or someone you have said no to. This person is a person who you have said no to. And this person bring in this imposter that have profiled some of you and that have pretended to be a businessman while there was a little hustler trying to figure out what is going on. And, um, you know, this person was just really off. And it's just sad. It's sad because whoever this person is has, brag, has, has dragged their wives, drag um, whoever in this. But I see whoever this person is there, you're going to be successful over this young person because, um, you know, a corporation institute have seen um, that this this person was lying and um, your enemy is down. Okay, some sadness for your enemy. Your enemy is down. Imposter is trapped with his wife and they are going to be apologizing to you for what has transpired. They're finally um, caught the big fish because it's as if um, it's as if whoever this person is, is the big fish. Um, and they, they finally caught the big fish because this person was controlling your enemy and was controlling hustler. Okay. And uh, they were selling people information to young women and getting them in countries, different, different countries. And, and they found out and you found out and took down your enemy, your little hustler and his wife. Bye. So, um, whatever is transpiring, I see an apology is going to be coming in. Um, people are going to be apologizing to you and it's going to be returning some money to you because it's as if they went as far as using your information to even get stimulus tech and taxes. And that's how they pick them up and they finally got the big fish they were looking for. So sometimes ladies and gentlemen, um, it is hard um, because sometimes things you're going through things, but you're healing thousand. And this is what I always say. If I can save three people from their identity being stolen, I will give up my life for three to see because I'm telling you identity theft, especially now 
and with these changes that is coming up it's no wonder that governments are locked down ladies and gentlemen because trust me all you criminals and all you people that have been working and using other people um um information it's stop it's stop okay it's stop because people are going to be seeing that you know you can um um order something under someone else's name people are going to see the truth I gotta go please like and share these videos remember that the weekly readings are here um, um capricorns be on the lookout oh my god I, I, i'm so long with you capricorns <laughs> um please share these videos namaste until next time